Did you ever tell Miss Allen that you were going to pay for the windshield? Yeah, hold on. Yeah, I did tell her that, but not because anybody had did anything wrong. When her husband came over there, like, he came that Tuesday. He, no, that day when he brought the estimate that Saturday, he was very respectful. I'm going to tell you why I didn't pay her. Your Honor, I'm laying down sleep. I got the cramps. You know how it is when us women have the cramps. We don't want to be bothered. I'm laying down <laughs> sleep. She calls me. She said, is Miss Phil up there? I said, this is me. She said, well, this is Valerie, and I want to know when I can come and get my money. I said, look, I got the cramps. I'm asleep. I will call you tomorrow after I come from the bank. The next words out her mouth was, you listen here. See, I've been more than patient with you. You don't think I'm going to give you nothing and you call me disrespecting me? Your Honor, this woman called my house to 3 o'clock in the morning telling me I better hide my car out because this house... Stand down. Look, roll your windows up because I know where you live and I'm going to come and bust your windows. So I'm going to roll my windows up so you can bust them. I had to go hide my car. Okay, so that's why you didn't give her any money. Ooh. That's right. I believe you. Mm-hmm.